Hello and welcome back to the Free to File. Let's play Mr. Alice, the Stargate Traits, the Stargate Utopia mod. It's in use here. Last few parts, guys, you're at war with Lord Hugh, Ra, and Apophis. With basically the rest of the galaxy at our back, either as our vassals. <laughs> or the SGC Project, which is actually our Federation partner. Kind of silly, but it helps. Kind of cool to have them. It's like a true to canon. The Foundation is a mass collection of planets. For the SGC, it's Earth and just a few outposts. It kind of fits, like the galaxy map or the S Stargate universe, if you actually think about it to where it would be if these system wards are actually still alive after Ball's ascent. I mean, Lord U was gone, Ra was gone, Apophis was gone, Anubis was gone, Sokar was gone. There would have been other Gaul to take their place, obviously, but it's still kind of cool. That being said, so right now we are currently just waiting for this truce timer to go away. There's about nine years left to go on it. And then I think after our next war, will we actually get the 40% we need? We might. We might. We shall see. We are training a ton of armies to counteract that problem. Okay, I don't think this sector needs to be an agricultural focus anymore. What sector am I managing? The PX12. You can go to a balanced one, please. That'd be awesome. Didn't mean to pause the game. Oh, and that temple's almost done. Nice. Alright, so what do we do? I think what we do is we flesh the fleet out a little bit more, just because we have some space and we have the resources. Is that the 10th force or what is this one? The first army. Let's actually bring our army up here. Scientists, you chill out. Construction complete. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm gonna do something. Oh, there's gonna probably be some haters to this, but we're gonna blow up the musicians. Gonna do it! I've actually never attacked one of these stations. I just wanna see what it happens if you destroy the artisan troop. I want to know what happens. I mean, the station's not gonna stand much. Get those fighters just go, tear it in. And oh, so you just get a bunch of resources. Interesting. Not what I thought it would be. Oh well. I thought like you get some type of artifact or some research chain to do, but I guess not. Okay. I mean, we could take out the Infinity Machine, too. I kind of like that idea. Let's take out the Infinity Machine. I have a scientist nearby. And I think we finished that entire chain, so it wouldn't really matter if I did that. I mean, do we have anything left for that thing to do? It's just a bunch of debris in the galaxy that I really don't care about. I mean, we've already completed them. Complete. 
Battleship assembly yard. So let's get going on logistics up. Cost and better build speed by wow, 25% build speed on that. Gotta like that. You don't even have a spaceport. Well, that's because you're that random system up here. What sector is that? Perfect. All right, that works. All right, our fleet's in position. Let's take it out. System survey complete. See what this machine gives us. I want to know. Plus, I want to eliminate everything that's like a guardian or a lot would die. With bias in the galaxy. Ooh, this thing can take a hit, though. Take that back. It can't. Super weapon get in range. This thing is ridiculous looking though. It is a weapons platform with a hainer bay. Wow, I want to build like a space station like this. Study its nature. You can jump back here now. Droids. Hmm. Let's research droids. I want droids. <laughs> we shall become the Separatist Alliance, my friends. <laughs> totally different universe, I know. Leave me alone. It is what it is. Let's see here. Did I get that? No, I did. Okay. I do see a research that needs to be done. Da -na 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 -na. Keep building the stations. So much to build. That works. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna pause the recording until the truce timer wears out. So it'll be like a millisecond for you. It'll be a couple minutes for me. See you then. Hey guys, back. Pulse here again. So I'm, I'm pausing the recording because we have identified the final part to the pre court the first league. So that's kind of, that's interesting. We haven't done one, we, we haven't finished this in one of my series yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to let this go and we're going to see where it leads us. I'm very interested to see what happens. So we found a derelict cruiser. That was the final piece to this puzzle. Construction complete. So let's see what happens. And yes, I've built a ton more battleships, too. I've built another eight. Alright, come on now. Almost there.
situation Pause. Okay. Where is this? Server that system. If we have to take out a Apophis, we will. Go to go. System survey complete. Come on, scientist, we need you to hurry up. Tenth Army now. Rally point. Send a bunch of cruisers their way. That way, at least, we can give them some ships. We don't have the resources for a full fleet, full wing of battleships right now. But a bunch of cruisers will help, just to build them up a bit more. Government, unspent physics, civics point. Wow, that twenty percent to consumer goods. <laughs> it's crazy. Right, let's start, start surveying this. Find the home world. I want to find it. Come on. Maybe the last planet you survey. Fascinating. So we found it. In the first we collapsed. So we want to get some unity, society, and influence. Oh wow. Well, that was a little disappointing. Alright guys, I'm going to pause the recording again until we can go to war. Alright guys, welcome back. We're about three months away from going back to war. And it looks like, okay, we have enough resources to really flush out the fleet a little bit more. So let's go and add a bunch of battleships in here. Start a new fleet basically. The 10th Army is not going to be the rally point. We're going to rally to the Kara. Real quick, let's go and trade away all of our minerals. I love being able to do this. I wish the Steralis New Horizons not have this ability because like, you have all the energy, you never have a place to trade it. The only trading post I've ever found of that mod was from the Ferengi Let's Play. And it made life so much easier. I had such an endless supply of like resources, I felt like. So we're gonna be training up 16 battleships that are gonna form up a brand new fleet for us. And with those battleships, we should probably start training. Let's train some Fa. Twenty-four Jaffa. Let's 
Officer as their ground force. And we can go to war, so once this is done, do that. Okay, if we go to war with Apophis, the SGC does not want to do that. Or not Apophis, go to Pra. So let's go against Lord Yu again. Okay, they vote yes now. But if I go here, declare war. I go to Abydos. They vote yes. Okay, they do. Sweet. So, PR6. P PC3. P2C. P2. P2C. Dash 106. And they have. LLA. Or is that I, I, is that I, L? L? Okay, is it? Okay, so they have a few of these. Well, we've achieved domination victory, gentlemen. So, I think we're just going to go finish this episode out, and that's where we're going to end this series. We have actually won the campaign legitimately. Is there any fleet we can take out real quick? Is there anything we can blow up just to make this a little bit better? There it is. There is a nice raw fleet. We are going to go... And we are going to go take them out. They are entering to Heaven's Gate. Where is Heaven's Gate? Go to Heaven's Gate. Okay, after Heaven's Gate, where are you going? Kadesh 3? that fleet go? Okay, we need to find that fleet. That is how we're ending this episode. Take a look at Harker Lanes from there. That's where they're going. I say we go there. 
system survey complete. Put our troops there. Oh, yes. There it is. Free Jafar have claimed the galaxy from the Gaul. Gaul are making their final stand. Oh, those Anubis super weapons just look amazing going through. Along with our Tari allies, we have conquered the system lords and put them on their knees. And we have claimed a rightful place in the galaxy. There it goes. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this series. I had a lot of fun with it. I feel like we could have upped the difficulty with them. And it would have been fine. I mean, I wasn't sure with how it would play out because I knew the Gwold would band together, which they started to in the end. But at that point, there was no chance for them. We had advanced technologically to be far superior to them. I mean, we saved the SGC, which was awesome. We didn't need to do that, but it was a really awesome thing, like just how the Stargate universe is. We came into the rescue with our fleet and just took the fight to Apophis and pushed them back and saved them. And now that they... Oh, that's our fleet that we actually built. I wanted to find the actual SGC fleet and see how they rebuilt, if they actually rebuilt anything decently. Just for my own... Oh wow, Sokar was starting to get a little bit more into a threatish position. But with that being said, guys, ciao for now. I hope you enjoyed. I will have a new series starting up soon, probably, in this mod again. Because the Ancient Empire Let's Play it should be finishing up around the same time as this one. Unfortunately, I was not planning that. But we will be going to do an SGC project let's play so we're gonna play as earth next so that'll be awesome it's gonna be fun and we're basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna have all the gold out there in the free jaffa we're gonna play it on hard and we're gonna play it on hard difficulty high aggressiveness as the ai so we're gonna be on our toes because that'll make it a really really big challenge because night it's 50 50 on those settings for me guys so we'll see where that goes I do have the Warhammer series starting off, which you guys should be seeing those as this video releases, or they should out, be out right around this time. So again, those are going to be a Vermintide kind of triop or co-op, whatever, whoever's on, but with Bob Hope and Tomato Tim, or as it goes now, Toucan Tim. So, and then I'm going to be having a campaign playthrough for the Warhammer 40k universe from Dawn of War all the way to Dawn of War 3, so that means we're going to be going through Winter Assault, Soul Storm, everything. And then we're going to be going through Retribution, the Chaos Wars, and Dawn of War 2. So since it's a continuous story, we're going to play from Mission 1 all the way through. And I'm hoping you guys enjoy it. I'm looking forward to it because I haven't played those games in a while, so it's going to be fun to relive those. And just to do something a little bit different, instead of a multiplayer, we're going to do a campaign playthrough. And we are going to beast mode it through on probably very hard difficulty. So, if you enjoyed, please subscribe or drop a like. 